Hello everyone, welcome to Knowledge Circle. In this video, we will see a Java program where we will check whether a number is Yvonne number or not. So what is Yvonne number? It's a number whose all digits are even. Some examples of Yvonne number I have taken here. So let's quickly begin this program. Let's open BlueJ. Let's create a new class here with the name Yvonne. Let's click OK and then we will double click on the class then the code window gets opened now we will clear the screen and we will start writing the code the very first line import java.util.scanner this is for taking input from user then the creation of class e1 and then after the scope of the class begins then we will mention the main function public static void main then the scope of the main function begins then we'll create the object of scanner class scanner object that is ob assignment operator new scanner system dot in then we'll create here two variables one n that is for taking input from user and c to count number of odd digits here i have taken c to count number of odd digits okay now we'll provide a message for the terminal window enter a number after this what user will give user will type a value so we will receive that value with the help of the uh, next int method and it will be stored into n now we will run while loop here okay while n is not equal to 0 and then what happens we begins we begin the scope of the while loop here we will extract by declaring a local variable d uh, the unit digit will be extracted and then we will look for odd digit we will check whether the digit is odd or not if d modulus 2 is not equal to 0 then c plus plus okay and now divide the number by 10 so that we can get the next digit okay and then the loop is closed what happens that we are checking here in the loop that if any odd digit is present if no digits no digit is odd then the value of c will remain 0 and if c remains 0 after the execution of loop it means that it is an Yvonne number. So we'll write here if c is equal to 0, it is an Yvonne number. I'll just copy this statement. I'll write here else and I'll paste it. And here I will modify the printing statement, not an Yvonne number. Okay, so basically we are looking here for an odd number, just opposite. And after this, we close main and we close class. We go for compilation, compiled, class compiled, no syntax error. We go for execution. Right click on the class void main enter a number. So here let's enter a number 24680. It's an E1 number. Now we will give something different. Let's give a value again 126840. Not an E1 number. 